I welcome everyone to our YouTube channel A Yogri Organics. In this video, we will see what are the documents that will be required at the time of ICR counseling. If you are new to our channel, you can subscribe our channel. Our channel is the only channel to give ICR regarding videos in English in India. So you can share our channel with your friends also. So it will be useful for your friends for attending ICR counseling and further upgradation of knowledge in agriculture. This is the world counseling brochure of the year 2023. During that counseling, what are the documents they asked? The same documents will be asked for this year also. One or two documents may vary, but most of the documents will be same. So we can see clearly in this video. So what are the documents that you have to be kept ready at the time of ICR counseling? We can see clearly in this video. So first is your proof of date of birth. It will be high school or class 10th or matriculation certificate. So that you have to upload at the time of counseling and you have to report to university after counseling. So this is very important document. So in this column they have given what are the documents that has to be uploaded at the time of counseling. And in this column they have given what are the documents that has to be produced to the university at the time of reporting after counseling. So these two are important. So first is your proof of date of birth. Next is all certificates and mark sheets great reports are related to class 10 class 12 onwards so for example if you are applying for pg then you are all 10th class 12th class then ug ug in 8th semester there will be there enough so during that time you may have got 8th semester mark sheets and finally you may have got pdc that is provisional degree certificate like that so all these are important so you have to produce all these mark sheets you have got from class 10th onwards Next is final year mark sheets or grade reports related to UG. For example, if you are applying for PG, clearly note this, this was for 2023. So during that time, they have given some excuse. If they have not got provisional degree certificate, they can get one certificate from the registrar of that concerned university. So that one they have mentioned. So here they told to upload that final year mark sheet or grade reports related to UG or bachelor's degree program or certificate from the registrar of that concerned university. So this year we will wait how they are giving this uh, format. So in that format you can get at the time of counseling. Next is admit card issued to candidate by NTA. So this is important after the completion of examination that admit card they may have given you back. So that admit card you can upload or else if you are not having that uh, admit card you can upload the fresh admit card also please you remember this if you are not having admit card please download that from that particular website so that is very important so admit card is very very important so if you are not having now you download from website with your login details further it may not appear after starting of counseling so now only you download that one if you are not uh, having the admit card that what you got back from your examination center you no need to worry because in that they may have done security check and they may have pasted something if it is not available also no problem you can upload a new next is a computer generate confirmation page of online application submitted to nta so this and all you may have taken printout or you may have downloaded at the time of application so that application is very important so you note down that one it no need to be uploaded at the time of counseling but it should be produced to university next is rank card issued by acr to eligible candidates that they will upload uh, very soon so during that time you can download this rank card next is allotment letter issued by icr to eligible candidates that you no need to upload now you can uh, produce to the university next is provisional admission letter issued by admitting university after your uh, seat allotment that particular university will give provisional admission letter that you can give to that particular university at the time of counseling next is passport size color photographs same uploaded at the time of on online application to nta so what the photograph you have uploaded to that one at the time of uh, online application so same photographs you have to give to your university also if you are not having you no need to worry you can give some other photos also next is other card or 28 digit other enrollment id or copy of passport or ration card this is just for the identity proof you can give any of this identity proof you have to upload at the time of counseling also next is domicile certificate so this domicile certificate is very very important if you have not yet got your domicile certificate you please get it from your particular talk office or register office through some e-seva portal you may it may vary depend on the state so domicile certificate or you can upload that nativity certificate so that is also okay if it is uh, not yet you got this domicile certificate you try to get this domicile certificate 
and uh, next is character certificate from the head of the institution last attended so if you have studied ug from any particular university you can up get one character certificate from the head of that institution head of that institution means maybe your principal or your dean so you can get from either of them or from any other higher authorities also not from professors or someone so you have to note down that one they have given head if you have got tc transfer certificate in that they will mention conduct so that is also okay you can upload a tc both at conduct certificate and at a tc so there will not be any problem next is copy of sc st ups and general ews category certificate at the time of uh, counseling so if you are belonging to this category you have to upload next is medical certificate in case of persons with benchmark disabilities it has to be uploaded as per the format that given by icr next is sponsorship or declaration certificate by the employer of the candidate this is for in service candidate in service candidate means some of the candidates those who are already working at particular university or somewhere they will be doing pg and phd for them they have to be produce this sponsorship certificate or the declaration by employer of the candidate so what we have seen till now is only for pg so similarly it will be for phd so for phd what they will ask means here they have given this ug mark sheet so similarly for phd application they will tell to upload pg mark sheet so this year what they will ask we don't know but most of the candidates those who have applied for phd not yet submitted your pg thesis so you try to complete as soon as possible and try to get the pdc as soon as possible if you have, if you are getting pdc as soon as possible then there may not be any problem but if there is some delay then there may be further delay also so you may not get seat at any particular university or your favorite university like that so it is very important you complete your pg as soon as possible and get the pdc as and tc as soon as possible and if you are not having any of these documents please get it as soon as possible especially you have to get the character certificate next is domicile certificate next is uh, category certificate so these three are very very important if you are not having any of this certificate what they have mentioned so it will be a problem to you in future at the time of undergoing counseling so you please get all this certificate if you are having any further doubts you can give in our comments here in our channel there is one playlist of ug pg and ph3 admissions and counseling icr and others for the year 2023 there are many videos uploaded in this playlist for example related to kerala agriculture university and related to ira hubs especially ira hubs for ug pg phd even some tamil videos also there and many english videos are there you can note down that one and many informations are related to icr counseling what are the process and the certificates related to counseling and how to attend the counseling and the experiences of some of the toppers in subjects such as forestry horticulture entomology and some other subjects also we have mentioned here so you can go through these videos if you are having any further doubts i hope this video will be useful to you for attending the counseling so if you are new to our channel you can subscribe our channel as i mentioned already our channel is the only channel to give agriculture counseling related videos in english in india so you can subscribe our channel and share our channel with your friends also thank you